everyone, this is Larry. Welcome back to todayifeellike.com. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to access the hidden web browser on the Nintendo Switch. So, let's go ahead, hop on into the Switch, and I'll show you how to do it. Here we go. All right, so here we are on my Nintendo Switch. And in order to access your secret web browser on your Nintendo Switch, all you need to do is just from your home page here, we're gonna go over to where it says system settings and click on system settings. Now from system settings, we're gonna scroll down to where it says internet and click on internet. This is now going to take us over here to where it says internet settings. So we'll click the internet settings. It's gonna say searching for networks. What you wanna do is select the network that you're currently using. So I'll go ahead and select mine. Now here where it shows your, uh, the network, once you've clicked into the page that you're, the network you're using, it's gonna say connect to this network, change settings and clear settings. You're gonna uh, click on the tab here that says change settings. So we'll click that there. Now from here, you're gonna see where it says uh, DNS settings and it's likely set to automatic. What you wanna do is go ahead and click on that and you wanna change it from automatic to manual. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on manual and you'll see there, it's now gonna give you the option of being able to put in a primary and secondary DNS. Right here in the primary DNS, we wanna go ahead and put in this address right here, which is 045.055.142.122. So just go ahead and put that in. And if you uh, don't know how to put it in, just simply click on it and you will have the option of uh, inputting it right there. So go ahead and put it in. And once you've done that, just come over here and click on save and you'll see it says settings have been saved, so click OK. And usually if you wait about eight seconds or so, it'll usually take you over to the, uh, the page where you can access your web browser. If that doesn't happen automatically, just go ahead and click back, and we're gonna click back again. We're gonna click back again, and we're just gonna keep clicking back till we get here to our home page. And now from the home page, what we wanna do is come over here to where it says news, and we're gonna click on news. And now we're gonna come up here to where it says find channels, and we're gonna click on find channels. And it may take a few seconds for this to load up, so we'll just have to be patient. And there we go, it is loaded up, and then you'll see here where it says welcome to Switch Brew DNS. Thank you for using our DNS server. So now what we can do is go ahead and click continue to Google. So we'll click that there. And there you go, just like that, we are now in the, uh, the secret web browser. So now if we wanna go ahead and look something up, we can, we can come up here and click in the box, and we'll just come here and we'll go to someplace uh, generic like CNN. So we'll go ahead and click on CNN. Uh, and there we go, we'll come over here and we'll hit accept and we'll click okay now and it'll start to load up there and you'll see there it's gonna open up, uh, it'll show the search results so we'll click on cnn.com and there we go, you can see we are now in the CNN uh, website there and we can go ahead and start, uh, you know, looking around, poking around. We can, you know, we can look at stuff and read articles and do whatever. Now there are some limitations to what you can do you're not able to actually watch video on this browser. It's unfortunate. Um, you may get a message like this as due to the page that all content will be displayed. So you can either reload it or hit cancel. I'm just gonna go ahead and hit cancel for right now. But you can't watch video. So if you come over here and you try and watch, a, if you click on something like here, it says men, solo paddleboard trip, cross Pacific breaks records. We'll click on that there. It'll take a second for it to load up. And if for some reason it doesn't load up, you can go ahead and come back and, uh, and click it again. So we'll click it one more time there. And there's the article there. So it's not loading up perfectly as you can see. Um, you know, it, it, does, uh, it does have some issues, but you know, I mean, it is what it is. It's a web browser, it's, it's, very, uh, it's very basic, but it does work. So, you know, it, it is what it is. So we'll just keep going back here and we'll go back again and see if we can get out of this. Uh, actually, let's just click X and we'll get out of it all together. And once you're out of it, if you come back up here to the find channels again, you can click that. Um, we'll click on news, we'll click on find channels, and this will take us back into the browser again. And so there we go, we can go ahead and click on uh, continue to Google, and then there you go, so we're back there again. So yeah, I mean, it's very, very simple. It's easy to use if you guys wanna check stuff out. So, you know, you can come and, uh, again, you can't play videos, but you can check out, you know, if you wanna to go to images or something. So we'll just check, we'll, uh, we'll type in something like, uh, we'll just type in dogs, 
And let's see here. So we can click that there. We'll type dogs and we'll click on accept and we'll click OK. And then there we go. It'll start to load up photos of dogs. So we can click on next and, uh, you know, and check out whatever there is. So if we want to see something like this little dude here, he looks like a cute little puppy. We can click that and there we go. So anyways, it's just a cool, uh, it's just a cool little uh, hidden feature in the Nintendo Switch. It's kind of cool to have and uh, have access to. And, um, you know, it's not hard to get to. You just have to know how to get to it. And once you're done with it, if you want, just simply come back here to your system settings. Come back down here and again to internet, internet settings. Again, go to your network that you're currently using. Click on change settings. And we're going to go back down to DNS settings and we're going to change it from manual back to automatic. And then we'll hit save. We'll hit say OK. And then we'll hit the back button. We'll hit back again, back again, back again. And this will take us back and have all of our settings back the way they were previously. Now, if you ever want to get back to your web browser, again, you just go into the system settings and DNS servers, and you won't actually have to put in the, uh, the numbers again. The numbers will be saved in there. So all you have to do is click on the, uh, uh, the manual DNS um, you know, settings there, and it'll be able to, you'll be able to access your browser. So anyways, there you have it. It's a little cool feature. Um, enjoy. All right, so there you have it. That is a look at the hidden web browser on your Nintendo Switch. It's very, very easy to access, as you can see, and it will, it will allow you to actually surf the web on your Switch if you like, so it's kind of cool. It's one of those things, that, you know, it has some limited functionality, but it's there if you need it. So if you want to use your Nintendo Switch as a web browser, so maybe your family has only one computer and someone's using it or whatever, this is a nice way to be able to still surf the web. So anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing it and I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and follow me on Facebook. And I am Larry with todayifeellike.com. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace.